So what does the parental control do on an Android? Let's explain that. Let's get started. So the parental control is a feature which you can find inside of the settings. It is located in the digital well-being and parental controls section. So you can get inside and set up, first of all, some app limits and screen time settings. But below you have like a dedicated parental controls tab, which you can manage and tweak. And it will basically limit access to certain apps, content and features based on age and the way that the parent sets it up. So you can manage it pretty well in here. At first, what's going to happen is that you will need to log out of every single other account except for one Google account on that phone. So you cannot have like more and switch in between. So that's kind of important. But once you go through the setup process and everything, you can restrict app downloads, purchases and in-app content even from the Play Store. You can set screen time limits and daily device usage schedules and some in-depth features which the parent can track like the location and activity, for example, even filters for safe browsing. So it, it's a very useful tool to just help you monitor the communication like calls and messages. So it depends on how you set it up and which device you use specifically because I guess some different phones might have slightly different settings, but generally this is the principle behind it and this is what it actually does, right? So there is also another like third party tool which you might use outside of these settings and it's called Family Link from Google. And this is commonly used to manage these settings remotely. So it is also a good idea to just connect it like that, right? So you can also do it from your, so you don't really have to grab the actual phone that is restricted, but you can also just grab your phone and do it like, you know, remotely. So that's also possible. Let me know below in the comments what you think about it, or if you have found this video helpful. It was just a quick explanation, so hopefully I managed to do that. Thanks a lot for watching, and I'm going to catch you in the next one in the future.